During the Stone Age, people in northeastern Africa hunted and gathered as a means for survival. This was their subsistence for life. This was during a time when vegetation flourished, feeding the people. It also provided food for the animals the Egyptians hunted. After a while, desertification occurred. This most commonly happens due to climate change or human actions. Water became scarce, killing all plant life, leaving people and animals to search for other sources. Because of this need, people moved into the valley of the Nile. The Nile River has several branches that stretch out toward the Mediterranean Sea. This has created one of the world's largest river deltas. The Nile Delta was formed because the river carries sediments and deposits them at the mouth of the delta, creating a triangle-shaped landform of islands and marshes. Because of the sediment deposits, the soil was very rich, allowing for the possibility of farming. The Egyptians were again able to produce food all along the river valley and delta. People were able to raise animals, including sheep, goats, and cattle. They also began to grow wheat and barley. This was the beginning of Egyptian agriculture. As the Nile River flooded over its banks, silt was spread onto the land. Farmers could then walk their animals along the river, pushing seeds deep into the soil. Although the Nile River gave life, it could easily take it away. When flooding did not occur, the land was very dry, and there wasn't any silt to plant seeds. If the river flooded too much, it would spill very widely and wash away any seeds already planted. For this reason, the Egyptians needed to invent a way to predict whether or not the river would flood. This led to the creation of a calendar which bettered Egyptian lives and reassured their survival. The Nile River, the giver and taker of life. 